Hi children, welcome back to the next session. Today let's continue our lesson, A Hero with a Difference. Today we are going to learn about a great hero of our country, Masudur Rahman Baidya, an historical swimmer. Children, take your textbook, page number 2, about Masudur Rahman Baidya. Hope you are ready. Let me begin. Listen very carefully. First paragraph. Masudur Rahman Baidya creates a history by crossing the English Channel without legs. The headlines of all the leading newspapers screamed the news of his success in 1997. Born in Balapur, West Bengal in 1968. Masudur, at the age of 10, had lost both his legs in a good strain accident. Children, let me explain. What was the headlines of all the leading newspaper? It was about our Masudur Rahman who crossed English Channel. Where and when did he born? He born in West Bengal in 1968. What happened to him at the age of 10? He lost both his legs in a good strain accident. Children, what is a good strain? Let me show a picture. Good strain carries materials from place to place. Then, how do we travel? We travel in a passenger train. It carries people from place to place. Is it clear, children? Then, let me move to the next paragraph. He came from a poor family. His father was an imam at the local mosque. After the train accident, Masudur spent one and a half years at different hospitals. His family thought that he would never be able to move freely or do anything for the rest of his life. But little did they know how brave Masudur was. Following his doctor's advice, Masudur took to exercising regularly. It was at this point in his life that Masudur also began to learn swimming in the village ponds. Children, let me explain. Listen very carefully. Rahman belonged to a very poor family. What was his father? His father was an Imam. Imam means one who leads prayer in a mosque. After the accident, what happened to him? He spent about one and a half years at different, different hospitals. His family members thought that he won't be able to move freely. But children, do you know he was a very brave man. He followed his doctor's advice and started exercising every day. And even he started to learn swimming in the village ponds. Children, hope you understood this paragraph. So let us move to the next paragraph. Swimming is a sport where one needs high mental and physical fitness. It demands high physical strength to move one's body through water and keep pushing forward. Masudur Rahman's body made it extremely difficult for him to swim. But he kept trying. His will to succeed and his patience were unmatched. Children, let me explain. Swimming is also a kind of sport like running, jumping, etc. Your body and mind should be healthy enough to swim. We should be very strong to push our body through water while swimming. Masudu's body made it extremely difficult for him to swim. Extremely difficult means very very difficult why 
Why was it difficult for him? Because he did not have legs. We need legs to push back water. But Rahman kept trying, even though his will to succeed and patience were not matching. Children, hope you understood these paragraphs very well. We will continue the lesson in the next session. Thank you children.